at the World Trade Center in Pasay City because it is the 7th edition of the Philippine International Motor Show. This is a much-awaited biannual event organized by the Chamber of Automotive Manufacturers of the Philippines. Today, we're taking a close look at the awesome Mazda booth that is bound to inspire and awe motoring enthusiasts of all ages. Waiting to greet us for the M2 Katana, M3 Speed, CX3 Front Wheel Drive Sport, and CX5 Diesel Sport. We also have the well-preserved MX-5 of the late great Filipino motoring icon, Mr. Pocholo Ramirez. Now while displaying some of the current models, Mazda Philippines is taking advantage of the spectacle that is pinned to launch a trio of beautiful vehicles. The MX-5 Club Edition, the Mazda 6 diesel sedan, and the CX-9 all-wheel drive signature. So of course we want to learn more about these three vehicles and that's why I have with me here Mr. Patrick Manigbas of Mazda Philippines to walk us around them. So Patrick, what is the essence of the Mazda 6? Okay Angel, so basically the Mazda 6 is Mazda's flagship sedan. Mazda Motor Corporation introduced this generation back in 2012 and launched it in the Philippine market back in 2013. And since then, there has been a series of improvements in the product for every two years or so. So let's talk about the improvements. I think very obvious is the grill. Yeah. It's completely new. Well, if you've actually seen the Vision RX Coupe, yes. which is the Mazda's latest concept car, shown in the Tokyo Motor Show last year, the Mazda 6 takes its design from that concept car. No? Coming from the grille, which is a very intricate uh, design, and also the sleek design of the headlamps. And by the way, the headlamps are also totally new. So it's a new type of adaptive uh, LED headlamps. So what you see behind us is the CX-9 all-wheel drive signature, which to my understanding is the top of the line of the CX-9. That's right, Angel. So what we've actually done here is elevate the status of the CX-9 okay. to make it the most luxurious Mazda in the Philippine market today. Wow, and that is not luxurious. That's right. All right, wow. Yep. It looks really nice. So you would notice it's now more luxurious and the feel is uh, much better compared to the previous uh, 2018 model. We now feature Napa leather interior. And of course, we can never miss Mazda's eye candy, right? The awesome MX-5. What's new naman? Okay, Angel. So we have here the 2019 mm -hmm. Mazda MX-5. This is actually a model that a lot of enthusiasts have been waiting for because it now features a stronger and more powerful engine, which is basically done through enhancements. It's still the same carryover engine from before, but Mazda engineers has in, have enhanced the tuning, so now it has 20 more horsepower wow. uh, compared to before. No? Really maximizing yes. the output here. Making it more exciting. No? <laughs> exactly. Now it's important to know that a Besides from showing us all these eye candies, Mazda Philippines also lets its Kim's visitors get behind the wheel and test drive these babies. So I'm with Levi and Meg who have just finished test driving the CX-5. What are your impressions? Well, my first impression is the the, the interior was really luxurious. Ah, and, uh, yeah. Okay. And the uh, engine is quite responsive nice. compared to the uh, the one we're using right now. I see. Kayo naman po bilang pasahero, what did you think? It was a very smooth drive. I didn't really feel the bumps. Yeah. It was really smooth. And yeah, it was nice. Yeah. Yes. 
people got to discover for themselves how Mazdas not only look good, but drive like a dream. So there you have it, another successful staging of the Philippine International Motor Show and another beautiful booth and amazing experience from our friends at Mazda. For the Philippine Star Wheels, I'm Angel Rivero. Thanks and bye-bye!